How this fighter shot itself down On September 21, 1956, test pilot Thomas Ottrich took on a crucial mission to evaluate the new supersonic fighter F-11 Tiger during its final trials. Tasked with testing the fighter's mid-air guns, Ottrich encountered a harrowing incident. After firing two bursts from the 20mm cannons, his windshield cracked, the plane shook violently, and the engine lost thrust, leading to an emergency landing severely damaging the aircraft. The post-incident investigation revealed an astonishing truth. Ottrich had shot himself down with his own projectiles. Though seemingly improbable, the explanation was quite straightforward. When firing a bullet from a gun, gravity and drag forces caused a near-parabolic trajectory. After the initial burst, Ottrich unintentionally deepened the dive and increased speed, while the bullet slowed down. At supersonic speeds, the shells caught up, colliding with the plane and causing damage. The fortunate use of inert projectiles during the test flight spared Ottrich's life, as explosive ones would likely have led to catastrophic consequences.